It's all calm at the headquarters for the Kimberly Clark Corporation in Irving. But this building is in a battle, competing in the 2011 Energy Star National Building Competition. This is the uh, EPA's building competition that we entered into, and we're in the competition with 245 other buildings. Robert Goodwin, customer relationship manager with Kimberly Clark, takes visitors on a tour showcasing the company's new energy reduction features. It's exciting to get an electric bill. Uh, we're trying to, to achieve a Energy Star rating of 75. So each month we're calling looking for our utility bill to see how much money we saved and how far we've gotten towards our goal of 75. It's all part of the Battle of the Buildings, a contest to see which building can reduce the most energy. This is a, a great uh, testament to being more efficient, uh, Energy Star rating, uh, as we become more of a greener society. Uh, we're very happy to have Kimberly Clark based right here uh, in Irving as one of our six Fortune 500 com companies that are globally headquartered here. Kimberly Clark had to fill out an application to be approved for the contest where we provided data over the last two and a half years of utility bills and information on the building size and occupants. Each team monitors their building's monthly energy usage. You have an account with Energy Star and each month the data you get from your utility bills, um, you enter into the account and they keep track of it and uh, based on the size of your building and energy usage and occupants and square footage, uh, they come up with the uh, data. Kimberly Clark has made a lot of changes throughout the 32-year-old building. Some of the ways Kimberly Clark is reducing their energy use is through natural lighting, using it wherever possible, as well as installing external awnings which keep the room warm in the winter and cool in the summer. We have replaced uh, the 32-year-old chiller with a new, more efficient chiller. We have installed ambient lighting in the parking garages and the parking lot. We've uh, replaced cooling valves, condensers, pumps. Um, we've set, um, put in a building automation system to, so we can track the energy usage and utilities. Many of these techniques can be used in the home to reduce energy costs as well. You can feel the difference immediately. A different type of lighting that's more efficient nowadays with LED lighting and CFL compact, compact fluorescent bulbs um, can be used in your house as well as here to reduce electric costs. From an enterprise value perspective, you know, having a competition like this, we tend to be competitive. So you know, getting the building engaged and trying to find ways to reduce the energy consumption is great. And then um, on a personal note, we um, have a website that shows our employees how in their lives at home and as they're commuting and you know, with their families, how they can reduce their <coughs> environmental impact. The city of Irving has many new projects built with green technology. I know that with our facilities, our convention center is LEED certified. We have a new a net zero library that's totally off the, the grid and that's saving the city uh, $85,000 a year. We are also uh, putting in place a lot of street lights on Irving Boulevard and that's saving the city another $75,000 a year. And it's energy efficient and it's a way where we can use the sun to light our streets. It's a fun competition that helps businesses take steps towards saving energy. We uh, encourage uh, commercial buildings to, to, to apply, uh, to go through this extensive process. Uh, we help them in terms of being civically engaged on how to teach other building facility managers on how to go through a similar process. And of course when they win, which we hope Kimberly Clark will, we'll certainly help them promote it. The winner will be chosen from a list of finalists and announced in November. I think it's sort of one of our core beliefs that, you know, good business has to be good for the environment and for the communities in which we live. So we're really focusing on being a good community partner. And then long term, we believe that things that if you're going to be successful in business, you have to pay attention to how you're impacting the planet. You can watch the battle unfold by logging on to www.energystar.gov and follow the progress of all the competitors. Valerie Mason for Envision Irving.